The Shock were one of the first seven teams to officially be announced as part of the Overwatch League. They had a rocky inaugural season, but they expected as much with how they built their roster. Instead of aiming to win the very first year of the competition, they signed two players that were too young to compete in the league's first season, Super and Sinatra. These two youngsters were widely touted as some of the most talented players in the world, and the Shock were willing to wait for them to come of age. With neither of their young stars being able to contribute until late in the inaugural season, they posted mediocre results. They finished ninth in the league with a 17-23 and 23 record, never qualifying for a single stage playoffs. Despite this poor performance, expectations were high entering 2019. The world could finally see the Shock's two young talents compete for a full season. The Shock proved immediately that they were a much better team in 2019. They finished the first stage with a 4-3 record, qualifying for their first ever stage playoffs. They swept through the quarter and semifinals before narrowly losing to the undefeated Vancouver Titans in the stage playoffs. While it wasn't quite the result they were hoping for, there was no doubt that the San Francisco Shock were now a major contender. In Stage 2, the Shock went 7-0 and proved their Stage 1 playoff performance was no fluke. They again walked through their quarter and semifinal playoff matches to find the Vancouver Titans in the finals. This time, the Shock would get the better of the Titans and win their first ever stage playoffs. The third stage of the regular season, the Shock took a slight step backwards, dropping two of their seven matches. Come playoff time, however, they once again found their footing and made it back to the finals. Here they found the Shanghai Dragons, who had upset the Vancouver Titans in dominant fashion. The Shock put up a good fight, but fell short 4-3. Despite the loss, the Shock had to feel confident entering the final stage of the regular season. They had been to all three stage playoffs and were one of the few teams analysts were predicting to win the 2019 championship. The only question that remained was how their young players would handle the additional pressure of knowing that everything was on the line. The Shock answered those questions resoundingly in the fourth stage, again going undefeated. Now all that was left to do was claim the championship. Things looked bad for the Shock when they were upset by the Atlanta Reign in the first round, sending them to the lower bracket. With their backs against the wall, they rose to the occasion and swept four opponents in a row to reach the finals. Here they again found the Titans, the team that had become their rival over the course of the season. To put all questions about which team was better to bad, the Shock dominated the Titans and swept the series as well, taking the championship in the process. For his performance over the course of the year, Sinatra was awarded the regular season MVP, cementing himself as one of the best players in the entire league. The Shock's gamble had paid off. When looking at the year as a whole, the Shock had an absolutely dominant 2019. They finished 23-5, went undefeated through two stages of the regular season, and made it to the finals of each stage's playoffs. They won stage two and took home the championship at the end of the year. Their incredible run was one of the most consistent performances at the highest level that esports has ever seen. They have set the bar that all future great teams in Overwatch League will strive to reach. Congrats, Shock.